good. All right. Good afternoon. Mayor Joe Yoakum, Council President Tim Salters here for our weekly update. It is March 31st. Um, today we had five new cases. We've had 12 new for the week, and that's probably been the highest we've been for a while. For six weeks. Um, uh, so we're still in a, a really good place with our numbers. Uh, County still blue. Still blue. Six weeks. Uh, Six weeks in blue. And we got to keep it there. Uh, I think statewide, 13 counties changed back to yellow, or that we are still blue, and we can keep it that way as long as everybody continues to do the yeah. the, the regular things. Wash your hands. Keep your distance. Wear face covering. If you're sick, stay home. Uh, and we encourage you to get the shot. Yeah. I've had the shot. I've had the shot as well. Uh, I don't have any extra arms. I feel good. fine. Feel eyes, good. So. Um, and, and the mayor, you're doing good too. No good issues. No, nope, yep, no issues at all. So uh, we encourage everybody to get the, the vaccine. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, as long as we keep our numbers where they're at, and we can continue to see things open up this summer or different events. So uh, can we go over the metrics? Yeah. So the metric numbers are really good. Uh, like last week, I told you we were an upward trend, and that was because of a 0 0.12 increase. Uh, this week, we are back in the downward trend mode just kind of expect you're going to see kind of ups and downs because our per percent positivity over that seven days it's going to kind of go up and down because we are so low when it comes to that so when we look at the county metrics we're 0.5 which puts us in the blue category um this week what we see is our seven day all test positivity is point uh 1.47 last week it was 1.8 so there's the drop and that's the downward trend you see cases per 100,000 is at 27 uh, last week it was 10. Once again, we are not the biggest county. So right. when you de do see numbers like that, and you put it into the equation, you will see kind of increases from there. Uh, but we're still in a really good spot. And I want to emphasize that when you look at our area, Knox County is in a really good spot. And especially we look at it and we were, we saw five today. And I know, oh man, that's, that's a big number. Right. Compared to what we have seen over this whole year, that's not a big number for us. And um, when we're looking moving forward, as long as we can keep those numbers low, we know that's not gonna completely go away, but we continue to learn how to deal with this. And I gotta give hats off to our businesses, our schools, and the individuals that are making sure that our county is in this place that it is. Um, and that's what allows us to be there. So uh, look at the things, specifically when we look at our positivity rate, it's hovered anywhere between somewhere in the mid uh, 2.5 down to the 1.5, even lower and gone under one. So it's going to hover in around there. Our cases have been in the single digits. Um, and we've had a lot of zeros that we've seen there. So our testing is up today. We uh, had 236 tests that were processed. So we're still making sure that those things are taken care of and look, looked at and gone through. So we're in a good area. And I know I like to kind of expand it. Southern Indiana is in a very good spot. Right. As the mayor said, there were 14 counties that did switch over. A lot of those were in the northern areas and not so much in Southern Indiana. So we just got to keep following those protocols. We got to keep moving forward because our goal is to continue to move forward. I have the events that we're uh, known for. Um, and, and if we keep following those protocols and we just keep looking out for each other. Um, and I would advise too, businesses are going to have their own rules, especially when we get to April 6th when they get to have those decisions. Be respectful of those businesses and what they want to do and what safety protocols they want to enforce because it is their decision and we do encourage those businesses, hey, whatever you feel safe to keep open, you do those things. Absolutely. So as long as we keep doing what we're doing, our numbers will stay. Yeah, they'll stay right where they're we'll at. stay in the blue as far yep. as the metrics go and that's exactly where we want to be. Uh, but again, everybody has to do their part. Yeah. And everybody has been in Knox County. Yes. And you know, we couldn't be more proud of the things that are going on. Um, Dr. Stewart's done a great job. Good Sam's done a great job. The amount of shots that are just going out of our area are just absolutely fantastic. Uh, and to kind of see those numbers every day just go up, uh, it's very, very impressive. So we keep doing the work, things are gonna be fine. And um, you know, it was kind of odd, I mean, a year ago to talk about getting back to normal. We're going to get back to normal. Um, and we're shooting for that. So. Remember those protocols. If you're able to get the shot, if you're 16 and over, right, 16 and over. I mean, that's, that's a huge, huge today. group that started yes. today. So yes. uh, go out there, uh, get the shot. Uh, we're good to go, Mayor. Let's hit those protocols that we've done that's kept us in a good spot. Wash your hands, keep your distance, wear a face covering, 
And if you're sick, stay home. And more importantly, if you can, get the vaccination. Have a good day. And then one other thing real quick, city offices are closed for Good Friday. That's kind of an important one too. Yes. Happy and Easter. Happy Easter. Yeah, we gotta remember that one. Right. <laughs> Have a good one.